Hello guys, May here and welcome to a another video of where USA is coming to San Diego. We are on our third case now and we just got promoted to investigator, which is exciting. So now we're going to see what we're going to do next uh, this time. And I know I mentioned in the last video that I was going to write on the comments, you know, to see if you guys wanted me to do like more exploration in the states when we go there but i'm just gonna do that anyway and i'll be mindful of that and now we're going to start on a new case so this is case three they're worried in wisconsin gumshoe one of carmen's crooks just ripped off the recipe for sharp cheddar cheese the dairy state is dumbfounded if cheese isn't safe in wisconsin nothing is safe in wisconsin Close this case, and you'll make many a cow very, very, very happy. <laughs> many a cow very happy. <laughs> well, this is the milk state, but apparently there's a lot of fish. Barracuda, trout, bass. Oh, I come back. Greetings. He hopes to make a splash in Palm Beach. That's gonna be Florida. So it's definitely a guy. Salutations. He hopes to roam free within the cageless confines. I have trouble describing someone whose weight is so ordinary. Weight is ordinary. Okay, average. How are you? Oh, he's probably having a blast at the Kennedy's. On a scale of one to ten, he'd weigh in at uh, a five. Okay, so it's average weight. Okay, so he's definitely in Florida. Ah, uh, shoot, I forgot about exploring the place. Carmine! Alright, um... So, if we want to look more into these states, we can definitely have a guide. So let's see that. Oh, that's cool. Whoa! I've an idea coming at ya. Don't let the youthful looks fool you. I'm a regular titan of tinkering and maestro of all things mechanical. Tantalizing technology and gallons of gadgets are my domain. Luckily, the good old US of A is brimming with cool engineering, so we'll have plenty to talk about. It may look like a stubby airplane, but this is actually the Explorer. A full-size space shuttle replica that people can climb aboard. The space shuttle represents a significant improvement over earlier rocket technologies. It blasts straight up into space like a traditional rocket, but glides smoothly back to Earth like an airplane. This gentle re-entry saves a lot of wear and tear, and allows the shuttle to be reused many times. Talk about your high-tech recycling! Where is he going to go now? This place is a tech lover's dream. The John F. Kennedy Space Center is run by the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, better known as NASA. Their mandate is to get things off the ground and into outer space, and they've gotten quite good at it. Here at the Space Center, we're surrounded by samples of stupendous spacefaring technologies. From rockets and lunar rovers to the space shuttle. Way cool! Want to hear a few more tidbits? Alright, tell me m more. Enormous dishes like this one are used to detect and communicate with objects in outer space. Especially satellites. Satellites circling high above the Earth have transformed the modern world. 
They're the devices that help us predict the weather, keep an eye on the planet below, and even watch live news coverage from around the world. Engineering types like me really like to stay connected, you know. The cluster of silent sentinels here is called the Rocket Garden, a showcase of many different rockets used at the Kennedy Space Center. Rockets have had a long, impressive flight path of evolution. The earliest ones appeared in Asia over 1,500 years ago and didn't have much power. But today's modern rockets, like the powerful Saturn launch vehicle, put out 7 million pounds of thrust or more. That's enough power to loft something bigger than a house up into space. <laughs> All right, thank you. Hmm, I suppose it's time to get back on your suspect's track. I'll scout around here for a bit longer and see what I can turn up. Remember, if you need help with a compu crook entry, give me a video phone jingle and I'll help straighten things out. How does that work? I tried that last time. All right, so let's see, we got her. Greetings. He's on the run in a state just east of Oregon. As far as weight goes, he wasn't carrying any extra baggage, but he wasn't traveling light either. Pleased to make your acquaintance. I hear he's on the trail of Chief Joseph, just south of the Canadian border. So that's somewhere near Canada. Don't bark up the wrong tree. His hair was acorn color. So he has brown hair look colored hair? La oh, lady. Hiya! I hear he has his eyes peeled on the nation's largest potato crop. So is Idaho? There's such a distance between his head and feet, they're probably in different zip codes. So he's fairly tall. Good to see you. Rumor has it that thefts are on the rise since his arrival in Idaho Falls. It probably got some snapshots of it. So he has a camera? Good to see you. He was bound for a state that is bound by the Mississippi River on the west and the Wabash and Ohio Rivers on the south. There was nothing extraordinary about his weight. Okay, so we didn't get much on his weight. Hi there. Hi there. When he hailed a taxi to the airport, he was waving a copy of the Chicago Tribune. His hair was the color of hot fudge. That's a very descriptive descriptive thing about a hair. How you doing? How you doing? He told me that he wanted to find out how his con act would play in Peoria. I heard him ask directions to the nearest dark room. Coupon off for 15% off of Come to Wasser Band's World of Belts for all your middle wasting needs. So. Going to Chicago? Illinois? Shaping up at the Green Animal Topiary Garden, but I'm still hedging my bets. He'd be head and shoulders above everyone in a room. Hi there. 
Nice. He said, I'm headed for so that's Rhode Island. State where Prava, Prava. And I wouldn't describe his weight as either jump. And when they're turning to the gardens, that's in um um. Oh shoot! There's there's the there's a there's a area in Rhode Island, um, where they have all the mansions over there, and I've actually visited the gardens over there. They're so beautiful. Glad to make your. He said he'd brook no delay. He had some fresh negative. Okay, so let's issue that, and we're going to Rhode. Oh, he's not going to Rhode Island. Okay. So we were completely wrong. What the heck? Glad to make your. He said he'd brook no delay. He'd wait nary a day before setting out to Narragansett Bay. Narragansett Bay is in Rhode Island. So, but there's nothing there. Hi and then, there. shoot. Uh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Hi there. Nice to. He said. I'm head okay, so what about the what is this lady saying? Nice to meet you. I heard him say things are shaping up at the Green Animal Topiary Gardens, but I'm still head. Oh sh crap! Oh no! Okay, there it is. Rhode Island's right there. I can't even see it. It's so tiny. Oh, How are you? Someone around here is looking for a safe place to hide. Oh, okay. So that's him. So first off... Let's request a guide. I have an idea. Precision bullseye! Your compu crook is spot on perfect! I couldn't have zeroed in on the facts better myself! Okay, so that's pretty much it. So I guess we're just going to uh, arrest him. Howdy. Pretty jazzy. <laughs> Luke and Furloot. You may have netted me, but my money is still on Carmen San Diego. I love to read good news about my agent. Nice work. From now on, if you're you're looking for Luke in for loot, look in prison, cause that's where you put But I just heard about a brand new burglary. Can I put you on the case? All right, so we're going to stop right here, um, and I guess it just depends. I think what you have to do is, like, before you reach that third state or fourth state, wherever um, the crook is, like, you ha you can use the guides there. So we were only able to have the one state, which is Florida, to get more information about it. I think it's more of, like, if you don't know what is in those states, you have to use that map over here. So that's why, you know, especially if you were still learning about those states back in history, you know, back in like, you know, elementary school or like middle school, that would be your best bet. So we didn't do too bad. All right, guys, thank you so much for coming into this new video of where in the USA is Carmen San Diego. If you like this video, give it a like. If you didn't like it, give it a dislike. Place some comments down below. Say hi. Let me know what games you want um, me to play next or what are some other retro games I you would like me to see. If you want, press that, uh, press that subscribe button and follow me on my social media channels. And I shall see you in the next video.